Hey, I'm Kimberly Sizemore from Camp Oaks RV, and today I want to talk to you about propane gas in your trailer. That's right. So I had a customer come this week and say they weren't sure exactly how much propane that they have in their propane tank. They wanted to know if they could get a little gauge or something, which you can do. But it's, it reminded me that I haven't taught you this little tip. If you're not sure how much gas is in your tank, here's a good tip. It's called the hot water tip. So propane in its liquid form is negative 50 degrees below zero. That's right, negative 50 degrees. So it should be really cold and you should be able to feel that propane in your tank. But on a cold day like today, I'll be honest, the whole outside of the tank is feeling pretty cold to me, but it's cold out here. So what I've done, I've heated up some hot water in the microwave. I don't know if you can see it, but it's still steaming here. So I'm gonna pour this hot water down the front of our propane tank, and I should be able to feel where that cold propane starts. I kinda already have an idea just based on feeling it now, but let's see if this works. I had to find a used camper because I know that all of our new campers come with full propane tanks. So I had to find a used one that I knew would have already used some gas. So let's just see if this works. So I'm gonna pour a little hot water down the front of the tank. And as I put my hands here, yep, I feel the heat from that water. And as I go down with my hand, I instantly feel where that propane starts. Right about right here, that's the line. So my gas tank here is about Oh, a quarter of the way full. So that's a good little tip for you. Let me do it again, just to be sure. Pour the hot water down. Feel with my hand. I feel that heat from the water. And again, instantly, I, I can feel the difference where the propane tank is cold. So this tank's only a, a quarter of the way full, but even that should last a while. Everybody asks, how long can I use, how long can I go with my propane? Here's what you use in your camper. Your furnace is always gonna use your propane and your stoves, your refrigerator may, and your hot water heater may, but everybody's different. So depending on how much you use those, everybody uses them uh, for different lengths and times. Are you doing off the grid camping? So now the new campers, we're starting to see a little change in this because all of our new campers, the refrigerators are really electric only. They don't use gas anymore and water heaters are the same. We're not seeing those so much with both gas and electric. Now, my personal camper has a gas and electric water heater. So when we're all about to take showers, my husband goes outside, turns the propane tank on just to get that water hotter a little faster. So gas will do that. It will get the water water hotter a little faster. Um, so it just depends, but your furnace is really what's going to eat the most of that propane. And if you're cooking, which I don't do a lot of when I am uh, camping, I don't use my stove a ton, I'm not gonna lie. And also we don't do a lot of cold weather camping. So our propane will last us, oh, forever, a long time anyway. It does last longer than you think it will. Just to give you an idea, I had a customer come in and she was worried about how much propane she would use. So she left her camper in the driveway, left the furnace on. She said she left it on a week just to see how much it used and she still had three quarters of a tank left. So it, it will last a good long time. You can use that furnace uh, for quite a while, but I will say if you have the ability to have electricity at your camper, you can plug in, then maybe just bring a maybe a space heater or something, a small heater, just that'll help take off some of that use of the propane and keep the space really warm as well. So that's another thing. But anyway, just want you to know these propane tanks, they'll last a lot longer. This camper of course has two. So this customer bought from us in December of 2019. This one's full, this one's still got a quarter of a tank. So I don't know if he's changed his propane tanks or if he just didn't camp a ton, but either way, uh, your propane tank should last you quite a while. If you're not sure though, how much gas you have, you can always do that hot water trick and see uh, how much you have left. Maybe that's a good tip for you. Do you wanna know something else? Is there something that we haven't talked about you wanna learn? Just message it to me. Maybe you'll see that on our next video. And of course, from Camp Oaks RV, we hope you're out there having fun camping somewhere this weekend. See you later.